Lula was a good dad bod. <laughs> My name is Jessica, and I'm creator and owner of Mac Daddy's Macaroni Grow. I'm Trish Levinson, and I'm the creator of the Yarn Kit. Well, my name is Michelle Yascott, and I am the owner of Be Lux Beauty Lounge and Licensed Beauty Professional. I help small businesses look larger than life through branding photography. That's my elevator pitch. I got it short and sweet, and I did learn that in Microenterprise back when I took the class back in 2014. So our Microenterprise program is a six-week program held over two nights a week, Mondays and Thursdays from six to nine, to help aspiring entrepreneurs develop a feasibility plan. Feasibility plan is about 70% of a business plan, and we talk about a few of the financial statements. One of them happens to be the cash flow statement. It's really important for entrepreneurs to know money that's coming in and money that's leaving their business. So that's a really important financial statement that we teach. Other things that we teach in the program are how to price your, your product or service, find out if there's a niche for your product or service in the area that you're looking to start that business. Microenterprise is really fortunate to have a very um, cooperative relationship with, both with SCORE and with the SBAs small business development centers and what works very well is this a student comes to us and they've got a, a business idea but we help them get it down on paper and what the end product is something we call a feasibility plan which is about 70 percent of the business plan at that point ideally they will get linked up to a score mentor who will then turn that that feasibility plans into a business plan and execute it and I think that combination works very well. We also bring uh, subject matter experts into the classroom to go over certain topics like social media. How do you use social media with the budget that you currently have? How do you move your business forward on social media? The goal of the program is to use what you currently have financially so that you can move the business forward and not necessarily have to go and get a loan. The nice thing is it's, it's relatively easy to start. It doesn't take a lot of money uh, to, to start. So my feeling is this, if the community is willing to contribute a little time and a little bit of money, they can make these things happen. The threshold is very low, but sometimes that threshold for, for uh, low-income people is, is a, a bit daunting. After successfully completing the course, certain participants may be eligible to apply for a grant up to $1,500 through a partnership with microgrants. We also are a trustee of the Kiva Zip, which is a non-for-profit crowdfunding loan for folks that are not ready for a conventional loan. They can't sit down with a bank and get a loan for their business. Since Goodwill is a trustee of Kiva Zip, what that means is once we vet the participant or the business for this loan, we send it to Kiva, which to them means that this business has been, vest has been vetted by Goodwill and by the coaches that provide this information in the class. We teach the students a process. And so in our class, they will learn how to start a business from scratch, but they've learned the process and they can do that again. It can be a new or maybe a, a different uh, business uh, down the road. So uh, that's, that's, that's the key. We, we teach them how to fish. We are in our 12th year of offering this program. We have over 983 graduates, and of those graduates, 571 have started or strengthened a business since taking the class. Um, I see them come in the door all goggle-eyed, sort of thinking, what did I get myself involved with? And about the middle of the course, they say they've got it. That's their aha moment. And by the time they're done with this class, they are confident, confident people. 